Yeah, how's it going, everyone? Maryland here, and that's right, it's time for more of Maryland's Pokemon Brilliant Diamond Adventure. Last time, I went through Mount Coronet, and I'm about to arrive in Hardhome City, but this time, I'm gonna procrastinate! No, I'm actually not going to procrastinate. I'm going to do the thing that I don't want to do, that I hate doing, but I'm going to do it anyway for science. I'm going to go back to the Wayward Cave on Route 206 and go through there. <sighs> I will be right back. All right, I've arrived at the Wayward Cave. Oh man, one of the reasons I hate it is you need flash if you want to see anything. So yeah, now you can get the TM for flash in the basement of the Orberg Gate, which requires Rock Smash. So if you didn't get that, this is going to be a pain, and that's where you get it. I think you can buy it later on, but yeah. Uh, I don't need Swift. I'm just going to put this on Squirrely here because I don't really use her for fighting for the most part. So yeah, <laughs> we'll have you be at least useful in this way. So Flash is one of those moves you can actually use outside of battle. There's very few places you can use it, but this is one of them. So here I am inside of the Wayward Cave. And I don't believe there's any exciting encounters in here. I don't think there's that many great items. I mean, unless they changed it in Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, like this is just such a forgettable place. It's so boring. I probably should have brought some repels with me. And you know, in the original game, you also needed a Pokemon with Rock Smash. So you need something with Rock Smash, you need something with Flash. You need, oh, it's just a pain. <laughs> and there's not even anything that great. Now, I don't know if they've changed like what you get as a reward in here. And I guess you can find Bronzor here, but you can find that right outside. Or you can find it in Mount Coronet. It's not like it's that exciting. Although I don't have one. I probably should get one at some point. Oh, well, I'm sure I'll run into more. All right. Well, at least there are some double battles here. Um, am I going to do it? I'm going to do it. All right. Let's let's take a chance. Wandering around, I got hungry, so I ate some wild mushrooms. They gave me gas, and I can't stop burping. <laughs> Burp. All right. It was worth going in here just for that. Just for that. All right. Look, a trader lost a wayward cave. You're boring, but the burping guy, on the other hand. <laughs> yeah. Lorenzo and Reginald. My goodness. <laughs> Burp. Oh, I love it. All right. I uh, kind of want to double team that Onyx. So let's go ahead and do that. I don't think Confusion will knock it out in one hit. Actually, in thinking about it, Confusion probably would take out that Geodude in one hit. Oh well, it's fine. We'll turn it into a two on one. Rock Polish, lovely. Doesn't really matter to me, but go ahead and do that if it helps you sleep at night. faster than either of my Pokemon. Easy! Oh, I'm a chop. Okay. This is fine. This is great. Alright, let's cut that thing. And confusion! I cut you with my ears! <laughs> uh, I need to give her a better move. Like, I'm sure we'll be getting better moves soon. But, eh, for right now, I think it's still better than Quick Attack. I'll take it. Ooh, Fury Attack. Eh, nah, it's really bad. <laughs> I think I'm getting better. Uh, I strayed for the battle plan. Why'd you have to team up with someone so boring, burping guy? You make me sad. Ah yes, Zubat. What a what a wonderful majestic encounter here. I'm so glad I ran into this thing. 
just, I don't know. I just feel like this is the biggest waste down here. I'm really hoping that they made it a little more interesting. Oh, super potion. Kind of hiding in this rock here. That's nice. Now, there is a trainer that you can add to your party while going through here. I need to actually rescue her. And I should probably do that before I fight too many other trainers. Just because it's like, I don't know, it's just weird. I just, I hate this place. It's like my least favorite place. I'm just going to complain about it all day. That's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to complain about it as I'm going through here. I'm not going to tell you how to get through here. I will tell you that the general direction you need to go is to the northeast. Like, I'll say that much, okay? I'm probably going to explore this whole thing. But if you just want to get through it fast, like, the northeast, that's where the, uh, the person I'm talking about is. The one that you need to rescue. And I really hope you have repels. I probably should have bought some repels. I did restock my potions, at least. All right. Oh my gosh! These encounters! Why? And look, it's like all super boring stuff. Ooh, Geodude. Ooh, Bronzor. Ooh, Zubat. Wow, such excitement. I am so glad I went in here. Now, the secret area of Wayward Cave, the basement of that, that's really cool. There's actually some good stuff in there. Oh, I cannot wait to use this. But yeah, this one is just, it's so bad. <laughs> it's so bad. All right, I think I'm getting closer. I think it's just around this corner. Uh, wait, how weak am I? Oh, I'm not weak at all. I'm strong! All right, let's go. What every good picnic needs is a cute setting, good food, and a fun battle. So why are you in a cave? Huh, are you lost too? No, it doesn't matter. Let's have a quick Pokemon battle. Why do all these campers go inside of caves? I just don't understand that. Like, if you're going to be, you know, going out camping, or if you're going to have a picnic somewhere, why in the heck would you be in a cave? That just doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Um, I guess I'll use Confusion on Metatite. It's neutral, at least. Should finish it off. Ow. There we go. Yay, Dan's leveled up. Probably have a long way to go before you're going to evolve. Oh, but that'll be great. That'll be great when the day finally arrives. A shinx. No! Stop with your intimidate! It's just so rude! Okay, let's do confusion and cut. Nice. <laughs> Why is it that you get the critical hit? You didn't even need it. Okay, well, there we go. How many more trainers do I have to fight around here? Oh my god. No, it's not even the right way! No! Oh no! Which way do I go then? Down here? I really should just catch a bronzer. I'm, I'll do it later. I'll do it later. I just don't want to fight you right now. Like, honestly, if I'm going to get one, I might as well get one underground, right? Well, I guess I wouldn't have an egg move. Because I kind of can't. <laughs> uh, look at this. It's just, it's, it's not fun. It's just not a good design. Like, the layout is bad. This is like the worst dungeon in this game. All right, so it's up here. It's got to be up here. And the encounter rate is high, too! It's like, man... This is the no fun zone. 
this cave is the cave of no fun. You go in here if you don't want to have a fun time. If you want to have a fun time, you got to go to the secret cave under the bridge. That's the fun cave. This is the no fun cave. This is the cave you go if you get really bored or if you want to get bored. I'm Mira. I was catching Pokemon. Then I got lost. I'm so scared. What were you catching? There's nothing interesting in here. Please, please take me to the exit. All right. Can I just use my escape rope? I'll keep your Pokemon healthy all the time. So that's the only bit of good news is she does heal your Pokemon up between each battle, which is nice. And she does have a Kadabra, which I guess is kind of cool. You know what? Let's do this fight. I'll see if... Oh, no, I'm not. I'm not doing this. I'm out. I'm out. This is going to take five million years. Thanks. Reflect. I'm so glad you used that. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Actually, it made sense. That's fine. I, I won't I won't give you a hard time. I was going to say, you know, we're probably just going to get hit with confusion and stuff. Didn't really think it had payback. All right. Let's just get out of here. Yeah, so she has a Kadabra. It's kind of there for support, but at least it's Kadabra, so it has more it can do <laughs> than Chansey. Which is just so boring. Like, so boring. Uh, you know, maybe this would be a good chance to get Bronzor. I know I was just saying, but, you know, that's also because I didn't want to bother weakening it. But if I have Mira out, I don't know. I don't really care. No, maybe I'll get a shiny Bronzor. Wouldn't that be wild? I guess that is kind of one benefit if you have uh, someone following you around is, you know, you're technically twice as likely to find a shiny Pokemon, right? Kinda. <laughs> All right, Dance. I'll lead with you. You look like you might just have the Pokemon I've been looking for. In deep tunnels and caves, there are a couple things you need to see. Zubat and Ruin Maniacs. Oh my gosh, they have so many Pokemon between them. Ghastly and Geodude. Oh, I hope Kadabra does the right thing and disposes of that Ghastly. It probably won't, will it? Also, Dan's just like outspeeding a Kadabra. Oh, Psybeam, yeah! No! <laughs> hey! Oh well. Honestly, that's probably for the best. Don't lick his spoon! Oh no, not Bronzor. Uh, shoot, there's actually nothing Dance can do. <laughs> Alright, I'm getting out of here. Let's send out... Floaty. Reflect. Oh, yeah, thanks. Really gonna help. Okay, actually, you know, every time I say that, it's like... <laughs> I feel like it's not going to help, but... It actually did. Alright, so we need to get rid of that Bronzor. Because that's definitely more of a threat. Let's knock it off. Wow, still not enough to knock it out. At least Ghastly's out of here. Oh, so close. You know, Reflect actually saved that thing. <laughs> That's the sad part. It actually did. All right, let's get rid of this Bronzor. Floaty leveled up. Yay. Kinesis, why? Why don't you just use... Stop that with the spoon already, okay? Just use Psybeam. You don't need to use Kinesis here. I mean, I guess it worked, but you know what? This thing would have been knocked out if you just use Psybeam. There. See, that's how you do it, all right?
Oh yeah. Now you use side beam. Okay, I see how it is. I see how it is. Good riddance. Yay, Squawk leveled up. He's so strong now. <laughs> They're too strong. I didn't, or you didn't have a single Pokemon I wanted. You're no collector. Wow, okay. Your awesome power, it's mystifying. Darn right it is. So what's over here? I won't even find out because there's wild Pokemon in my way. Again, it's like these are the only three Pokemon around. Bronzor, Zubat, and Geodude. I, that might actually be it. I don't know if there's anything else. I mean, again, it's so boring. It's so boring. All right, Tiny Mushroom, thanks. Getting in there, but you know. Do you say anything if I talk to you? Wait, what? This cave is so easy to get confused. Don't know where we are. Marilyn, is you gonna be so good because you're always with your Pokemon? Yes, that's it. Or that has to be it. I'm gonna try like you. Wait, you said something about minimize. She said something about minimize. She doesn't even have minimize. Why would she say that? I was mashing through it too fast. I just barely missed it. Maybe she'll say it again. I don't know. Maybe after the battle? Let me talk to you. <laughs> Fine, be that way. Ugh. Just let me out of this cave. It's the cave of misery. This is like not rewarding at all. Like I kind of just want to lead her out of here, but I also kind of want to fight in the double battles with her just because it's like, I feel obligated, you know? Yeah, she's always saying that line. Okay, so I don't remember if I went this way. I guess not, because there's a rock here. Let's smash that. It's, oh, here we go. Another picnic in this cave. Where am I? Am I lost? Who are you? Are you a Pokemon trainer? I forgot! Humph, you're lost, aren't you? I'll guide you even if you can if you can beat me. Now also I should mention you can talk to these trainers to fight them individually. If you don't want to fight them in a multi-battle or a double battle. Oh my gosh, what is this? Why? Why? I really wish Team Galactic would just swoop in and steal their Pokemon right now. They're always stealing these things. Okay, at least you have the decency to use Psybeam and take it out right away. Okay, Beautifly. Let me guess, a Dustox. Yep. Well, at least they give good experience. Oh yeah, thanks. Oh man, all right. Oh right, I was wondering, why did you outspeed? It's because you didn't get hit with string shot. I'm honestly gonna need to call my doctor after this fight. I'm dying of boredom right now. I am just dying of boredom. I need some cure for it. Just save me. Get me out of this cave. <laughs> Get me out of here. I hate this place. Honestly, this is one of my least favorite places in all of the Pokemon games. I like this place less than I like Hoenn. <laughs> that should tell you something. I'm not a Hoenn fan, I'm sorry. Sorry, all you Hoenn fans out there. 
But I've really realized that. I think a lot of it is I just don't like hoeing that much. Like, it's not the worst thing ever, but... I don't know. Alright, anyway. I just don't like this place. I don't like it at all. I don't! I want out! <laughs> Get me out of here! A Bidoof and a Baneri. Okay, well, that's about what I have right now. I have this Kadabra that sure acts like a Bidoof. There we go. Bunny fight! <laughs> Reflect. Okay, hopefully that protects you from, like, bite or something. Oh, headbutt. Okay. Oh. <laughs> that Baneri was her only Pokemon. Okay. Well, this is gonna be easy. Like everything else in this cave! Yay, Squirrely, you leveled up! Electro Ball. Um, I guess I can get rid of Spark, right? Yeah, not that I ever really use you. All right, Mira, can I ask you a favor? Can you just wake me up when we're done? <laughs> I'm just falling asleep here. I'm falling asleep. I can't stand it. I'm just, I I just can't even. This is just, ugh, an ape bomb. I feel like you can find ape bomb somewhere else. Like that would be the only redeeming thing. Let's say, let's say you couldn't run into ape bomb anywhere. Well then, you could say, oh, well, you know, when I need to complete my, uh, my regional decks, when I need to see everything in the regional decks, at least there's Apom in here. I don't think that's the case. I think you can find Apom elsewhere, like in a trainer's team. But that would be a reason to go in here. There's just, there's no reason to go in here. It's just, like, a waste. I think if this is the TM, come on. TM32, double team. Yeah, great, thanks. You can buy that. You can buy that for like nothing when you get to Veilstone City. So it's not even worth it. Like with the game corner not even being here, it's not even that expensive to get things. You don't have to worry about using the the game corner coins. It's just, you just buy it. And it's just, I mean, that's nice. Don't get me wrong, that's nice. But it's like, there's no reason to go in here. Like at least in the original game, you know, that was kind of a reason. Kind of. You can get a TM. One that's a little trickier to get. You gotta pay coins for it in those original games. In this. Oh yeah, there you go. I mean, that's the reward. That's it. I mean, that that's it. How do I get out of here? I don't know how to get out of here right now. I'm like boxed in. Mira, why didn't you just keep teleport on your Kadabra? You should have just used that. Then you wouldn't have had this problem. You could have just teleported out. You could have just had an escape rope with you. Why not just faint and go back to the Pokemon Center that way? Just let me out of here. Uh, I hate this place. I'm losing my mind in here! Okay, which way? No, it's not this way, because that's the way that- No, it is that way! How do I get out of here? I feel like that's just where I came from. Is it further down here? Oh my gosh, thank goodness! Oh, I'm finally out of here. Oh, there's the exit. I want to get tougher so I won't be such a scaredy cat. Marilyn, bye-bye, thank you. She doesn't give you anything. She thanks you and that's it. And then she just pieces out. And that's it. That that's that's it. What did we accomplish in this episode? We did nothing. We we saved her, but 
so what? She's not a real person. She's an NPC in a video game. It's not like we were even doing anything heroic here. Like, we got double team. Oh, great. We're really going to be feeling great about that later on. Boy, who do I want to teach double team to right now? Hmm, I can't think of anyone. I just want to get out of here. I wish I could double team my way out of this cave right now. And you know, I could use an escape rope, you know, that one I found earlier, except I'm at the exit. And the encounter rate is too dang high. Just get me out of here. <laughs> Let me free. Just get me out of this cave. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. I am so glad I never have to go back in here. Ah, good riddance. Good riddance. I'll see you on the next episode of Maryland's Pokemon Brilliant Diamond Adventure. See you next time, everyone.